Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Just Heard I'm playing Persona 4 Golden. Last episode, summer vacation ended, <laughs> school began, and this episode we're going to go in. actually finish up some quests that I should have done a long time ago. Well, which I couldn't do because school was not open. Alright, yes, give you the charm veil. It's amazing, I feel different just having this veil near me. Oh, but if I put it on, suddenly I'll start, uh, I'll stand out and everyone will look at me like I'm crazy. Oh no, oh, I'm sorry, I I'm just thinking about myself again. Uh, please take this. And I get five keys. <laughs> really, thank you so much. And we get the Charmed Veil. Or, oh, like, we finished it. <sighs> Whatever, we finished the quest. Alright, there's some other quests for me to finish. Uh, it's Friday, which means that there usually isn't anything to do. It's also raining. Which means that there's absolutely nothing to do. <laughs> I think, for me, at the moment. You're the cleaning club dude, right? Or quite fitting. Also to find the proper closing. Right. I need to go into a hospital for that. Well, well, well. Back once again. It's the incredible, the magnificent mentalist. I knew you'd be back. I crafted new riddles just in case you were ready for a new challenge. I was not. It's not like I'm ducking the books or anything. I'm just looking out for my fellow riddle friends. Or fiends. <laughs> Bring it. Uh, Riddle Senpai Returns. Ah, oh, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. No flipping the script. It's another categorization puzzle. This one's not the this one's not the baby school, though. You know what? I'm not in the mood for these freaking riddles, so I'm just gonna go and look at the answer. Uh, let's see. Where's the real thing? Yes, Riddle Senpai Returns. Uh, let's see. This one's not a baby school though. Three, two, one, get loose now. Skateboards in group A. Go karts in group B. Egg timers all up in group A. Alarm clock is strictly group B. So what does protractor roll with? Group A or group B? Um, group A. So what's the reason all these seemingly unrelated things are all tied with each other, huh? Um, oh boy. Human motion. Oh yeah. You could rock the nation with the, your dis dissertation on categor categorization. Obviously, any chucklehead could see that they're all items that commonly require mechanical energy from a human. No victory dance yet, because I'm going to hit you with the B side. Here comes the next one. Gorilla represents group A. Elephant is group B for life. Coffee makes uh, coffee maker goes all the group A par to all the group ba A parties. My god. Egg beaters always at the hottest group B uh, nightclubs. Whose phone? Calls, uh, whose phone calls does Avalanche answer while letting the other group go to voicemail? Say it loud. Um, that'll be group B. You know what's up. So tell me what the di uh, what the dealio is. Lay out the likeness for me. Uh, what is it over here? They're indefinite articles. Boom, though. You got them both. That's two riddles in a row, so you're also on fire. Dag, yo. That's impressive. Even though I should have pro uh, probably just expect a wunderkind like you. <laughs> <laughs> to have no problem. So you saw the gorilla has three syllables, but it was in group A, so it had to be that the group B used uh, all used un for most. Okay, you know what? I need to go to the bathroom. <laughs> I don't. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I, I've been fighting this. That's why I'm trying to get to this quickly, but I can't. I'll be back in a moment. <sighs> okay. So I uh, I don't remember what I was uh, where I was reading, but I'm just gonna go and begin from this. For most defi uh, definitely knowing your indef indefinite, indefinite, sorry, article uses, here's some plat loot just for you. Snuff salt. Meh, that's good, I suppose. Could be better, but it's fine. I don't expect anybody to be on the roof when it's raining. Or are you the person I need to help? I want to get a meteorologist when I get. I want to be a meteorologist when I get all. Want me to give you the weather forecast? Oh, <laughs> I'm always right. If only all meteorologists were like that. Well, they probably say that they're always right, but it's not always true. Right. Uh, nothing happening over here. It's raining, so there's no sports. Right. We have this lady. Who said she was going to talk to me, but... Oh, Senpai, uh, about this case. Oh, no, forget I said anything. Seems deep in thought about the murders, but uh, but won't talk to you about it. If you had more knowledge, he might act differently towards you. <laughs> That's interesting. I'll get more knowledge eventually. 
Wait, isn't there also another quest from um, Egyptian lady? I think eventually, but not now. It will unlock on a later date, probably. Alright, let's go up to the practice building. Because I know for certain that there's a quest I can finish over here. Uh, there's also a new one to get. Midnight channel was actually uh, revealed. I'm sorry, the Midnight channel actually revealed who the culprit was, huh? I don't like that. It would have been better if it showed who your true soulmate was. If these are all just silly fantasies, I'd prefer the one with a little romance. Alright, I have another request for you, if you'd like. Sure. Can you use your connections to find me a mineral? I need a silver needle ore. Well, I mean, it's kind of ore. Silver lump, that's what I need. It may be pretty hard to find. I give you a reward, of course. Something you can't find in stores. What do you think? Can I leave it to you? Sure. Hey, thanks. I'm sorry for always giving you these strange requests so suddenly. Right, good. So that's another quest that I need to go and do eventually. So many things to do. So little time to actually do them. Well, that nah, just so little uh, in the mood to actually do them. Hello. Uh, just because it's some vacation doesn't mean you can use your daughter like an uh, like a like an indentured servant. All I did with all I did the whole break was pick weeds because my stupid parents didn't want to spray herbicide. herbicide. We could have just bought a machine to do that, but oh no, there's no money for that. Maybe I'll suggest we go uh, in on one in on one <laughs> as partners with some other field towers owners, whatever. You hand it over to the reflecting board. Is this really it? No, I'm not done you. It's just so hard to believe. I'm gonna go straight home and try it out. Here, you can have these. Snuff souls. Neatly wrapped snuff souls. Huh. Let's go into town, because there's nothing to do in school. Except study, of course, but... Who wants to study? Ugh. I guess I can go to Okina City, see if there's anything to do over here. And then it just doesn't rain over here. That's very interesting. There's a new quest, huh? When I see a group of three in a movie, it makes me think that not all of them will survive. The hungry one always goes out to find food and then gets uh, infested, sorry. Um, I know it's a sudden, but do you like strange things? Sure. Really? Then I have something to ask of you. The other day I saw a movie about ooh parts. I didn't know what they were, so I did some research, but I still don't get it. If you know anyone who knows a lot about them, could you ask it about, about it for me? Sure. Thank you, I can't wait to hear the answer. What was in that movie? Ooh parts, huh? Zombies don't count as that, do they? I wish I knew someone who knew a lot about history. Um, okay. I <laughs> still can't get into this. Probably never can. Let's see. Uh, there's nothing else over here. Let's go back to Inaba. Inaba! Let's go over to the central shopping district. Alright. Um, is there any new books? Aha. Uh -huh. Man God. Food fight. Effect of eating Chinese food. May raise your courage. There we go. Might as well. Guess I can work on my courage. My courage. <laughs> I'm thinking about going to the library, actually. There's just nothing else I can do over here. Yeah, let's go to the library and study a little bit. Just a little more. Or is there something to do in Jeunesse? No. There's never anything to do in Jeunesse. Let's go back over to the high school. Where? Let me go and take a look at events, actually. Uh, school trip. Okay, yeah. 9-8. 9-8? <laughs> right. Uh, the library. It's not over this way, it's over this way then. And to the left, in the back of the hall. Yep. I want to work on my notch so I can talk to uh, Naoto. Notch has increased. Notch has increased. Notch has increased. <laughs> Still not enough though, holy shit. I need a lot of knowledge. Well. Ah, uh, Dojima. I was thinking about reading a book, but I guess Dojima's here, so I'm not going to be doing that. Yeah, I think I'll continue working on Dojima. Won't become closer yet. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, wait, I can't leave for him here. Right. 
I'll go and spend time with him then. Alright. And now we have a normal day. Another rainy day in any case. Alright, I can spend time with the strength club. Yours okay? Okay. Kinda wanna finish up the strength club though, and the, the other ones. But I should go and get a strength persona then. <laughs> so, you're the person I need to help. Huh? What? Don't you just walk up to me and talk to me all of a sudden? Don't you know what? That's rude. Oh. Um. Sorry for blowing up like that. Let me go and take a look for a moment, though. I want to see what I need to do for this quest. Uh, talk to the girl and... Sorry for blowing up like that. It's fine. I'm not in a hurry to go anywhere or anything. So, pretty much just mumbling and obviously flustered. Perhaps she's the one who wrote the Emma request, the, sh the fox, the shocks, no, the fox sword. She wants to improve her conversational abilities. What do you want? Stop staring at my face. Her words are harsh. But you dealt with the cold response, well, due to your understanding. What? Normal people would have left by now, yelling something like that. You're weird. What are you standing there for? Say something to me. You got that? The awkward girl ran away. Maybe you should talk to her again next time you see her. So... Uh, looks like another speak better, and then let me teach you. Talk to her the next day. Wait. So she just left. I guess I need to go and look for her somewhere else. Question mark. Well, I'm not sure if I'll find her anywhere in school in this day. Might as well go and take a look to see. Just to make one of them sure. I only just remembered how hot it actually becomes in my room when, like, once summer actually hits. That's in real life right now. Summer has hit and it's hot in this place. Okay, Rize has time. Kanji probably also. Okay, let me go into town because I really want to finish off the strength and the uh, the sun arcana. This is really interesting though because. I finished off some of the freaking social links and that actually really helps me out. Alright. Let me go and see if I can fuse. So Osa is the one that I found earlier. And Oberon is one that I wanted to hold on to. And then this is one of my good my, one of my better ones. Um What would this give Oh it would actually give me a strength one. Hanuman. I do use this guy a lot, but I don't know. I don't use Osei like ever. <laughs> let's see. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. So, um, I like Marakukaja. I like uh, what is this? This move damage all foes with a chance to fear. Twelve foes with a chance to panic. Uh, medium damage to one foe. I guess almighty damage is pretty dang, pretty dang interesting. Black spot is pretty dang good in general. I don't know what mighty swing does. It probably does an AOP attack. So let's go for let's go for black spot. <laughs> right, I rank seven in this. Actually, I was thinking about it. Like some of the personas I'm going to be making are going to be ridiculously powerful with my links, my links. Yeah, sure, and my social links right now. Right. As we get Blade of Fury. And as we also get Dodge Wind, even though it's not really that applicable to this guy, but. Uh -huh. Okay, so I have my strength person right now. I don't think I need anything else for the time being. Uh, nope. <laughs> Still need to fuse personas and get Margaret's stuff going, but that can wait for a bit. Let's go and spend time with the sports club. Who's that gummy? Okay. 
because I'm pretty dang close to finishing him. And this will also give me more diligence, which is my lowest stat, so... Yo, Fred, I don't say Ko, but you've got practice today, right? Yes. Haha, <laughs> you're really getting into it. Here's the Gami Hygiene. Hey, Fred, I'm about to... Uh, I'm gonna head out to the orphanage. I just wanted you to know. Later. You watched Koei leave, or Ko, sorry. I noticed, I noticed that I said Koei constantly wrong, but it's Ko. Then practice with the rest of the team. Things have increased. Yo, Yo, hey, uh, where's Ko? You told Isaki that Ko went to the orphanage. Today? Hmm, kind of worried. Hmm, let's catch up then. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's a good idea. Let's call the day. We decided to go meet Ko at the station with Isaki. Yaso Iniba, Yaso Iniba, Yaso Iniba, Yaso Inaba station entrance. What are you two doing here? You two doing here? Hm. You're right. You guys came all the way here, out here, just to uh, just to worry about me, <laughs> losers. The orphanage hasn't changed at all. The teacher, the teachers even remembered who I was, and they really, uh, they were really nice to me. But they said they can't tell, uh, tell me who my real parents were, or are, sorry, or why I was left there. No kidding. They did give me this, though. I've been too scared to read it by myself, but it's a letter from the person who left me at the orphanage. Yeah, I'm gonna read it. Dear Koken, by the time you read this, you'll have grown into a fine young man. Your parents named you Ko because they hoped that you would always be in good health. They considered health more important than fame or money, because it's much harder to keep and maintain. You see, your parents were very frail, and they passed away about half a year later, uh, uh, half a year after you, you were given up for adoption. They always wanted you to know how sorry they, uh, they were that they couldn't raise you themselves. They loved you very dearly. Ko, you are your parents' ray of hope. No matter how difficult things get, hold your head up high, and keep pressing onwards, you can't lose hope. Both of them would undoubtedly say we will be watching o over you always. No names, no single clue. My real parents are dead. <sighs> I was half expecting something like this, but it's still pretty shocking, you know? I have no one. That's not true. <laughs> I think so? I really don't know anymore. But I'm glad to have found out. I'm glad to have this. Thanks, man. Koei smiles weakly. Nice. Rank 8? Yes! It's gonna get dark soon. Let's head home. The others are worried about you too, you know? Alright, let's go home. After seeing Koei, you parted with Dice again and went home. Interesting. Hello, Dojima. Kind of wondering why I can't spend time with you, but I guess I'll just go and read. Work on my stats. Oh. So, text message from Yukiko. Do you like scary movies? There's this new horror movie out called One Missed Text. I don't think anyone wants to go with me, but I don't want to go see it alone. If you want to see it, call me, please. Uh. Yeah, sure. I'll go and do that tomorrow then. Matter. Even though I absolutely despise anything that has to do with horror, but you know, that's. This is not me. <laughs> this is an in game character. Uh, yeah. What are these things? Understanding and understanding. Okay. I guess I'll go and do Man of History. I can finish it in one evening, so. Alright, since you've finished hyperspeed reading, I can now finish it in one thing, which will significantly increase my courage. Oh, it's a free day, right? It's Sunday. Sunday, bloody Sunday. What should you do today? I'm gonna go and watch a movie with you, Kiko. I'm sorry, I'm gonna get called. 
Can I pitch today if you have some... You know what? This is actually better. Yes. This is better, because this is like... This gives me the ability to rank up. Okay, that's grocery. You can go brought you here. I wrote down everything I need, so this shouldn't take that long. What you making? Uh, Promise uh -huh. you won't laugh? Miso soup. You can look sufficiently embarrassed. I'm studying the basics of the basics, but it's not turning out quite like it does in the book, even though I'm following the directions. Hmm. Want me to teach you? Hmm? What, really? Oh, I'll pass, but thanks anyway. God, fucking wrong answer. I think there's no point unless I do it alone. Our cooks help me out all the time. At first they just give me advice, but eventually they take the knife from me. So even if the meal turns out wonderfully, it doesn't mean anything that way. I told them to leave me alone, but they will stay and watch. Hmm. Are they that worried about my cooking? Hmm. They care about you. They care about me? D do you really think so? Hey! Last time the head chef took the knife from me, shouting, I can't stand to watch anymore, and made the rest. <laughs> the waitress saw it and said to, to, the, to the head cook, You could go once to make it herself, even if it's off. Before I knew it, I was studying how to cook for a boy I like. <laughs> my parents got involved and it exploded from there. <laughs> Funny, wasn't it? Or isn't it? But maybe it wasn't all a lie. T taste my food again, okay? Yukiko is blushing. I felt a faint hint of love from Yukiko. <laughs> well, that escalated quickly. I guess I'm at rank 6. Not too big of a surprise. And she gets Amrita. Cures all ailments except down and KO for the party. Get rid of Nipatra. <laughs> yes. That's amazing. Um, oh yeah, shopping. Hmm. Alright, let's Interesting. Hey, Dojima. Dojima! <laughs> Still love saying that. One that comes sooner, uh, closer yet. Sure, I don't care, man. I really want to work on Dojima. I want to make it so I can leave the house. Because <laughs> I feel like if I if I give him max rank, I should be able to leave the house. And if not, well, fuck you, Dojima. Time to the cinema, people. You over here, students talking. You know, I don't really see the police in town anymore. I've seen on the news that there are, there are still some loose ends to this case, but the police are ready to end any, everything. What? You mean those murders? Why are you still thinking about this stuff from that far back? Ignore that. The school trip starts on Thursday. Both the first and second years are going. I might end up in the same group as Suzette. I'm so looking forward to it. She, she never even cared about idols until now. <laughs> Alright. Morning. Main school? Yep. Looks like we're having quite an eventful year, it's so weird. After the murder incidents, an idol comes to town and then a detective shows up too. This town used to be so carefree, every year was more of the same until this year came along. Anyway, I'm supposed to cover Haiku today. Get out your test books. Haiku, unlike Senryu, contains Kigo, which are words or phrases that can be associated with a particular season. Alright, why don't I test the waters with a Kigo-related question, Frecha. Which of the following is a Kigo for fall? A key go for fall. Sense of peaceful, rain, or brisk. Rain? Well, I don't blame you for getting this one wrong. Nobody really cares about Kiko in our daily lives. While brisk is an adjective, usually used regardless of season, it is a fall Kiko. I have no idea what this means. So if you're writing a haiku, don't use that word to describe a season that isn't fall. I gave the incorrect answer. <laughs> you fool! Nah. I don't care. Not enough in any case. Hey! Time for a little intervention! Hope I'm not interrupting! I'll decide later, buddy. You gotta be kidding me! <laughs> uh, sorry, guys, okay. This is probably, yeah, you me. My surface, I can't my guard time. See you later. Wow. I thought I was gonna get an intervention from more people, <laughs> but no. Teddy, it, what are you doing here? Teddy is sitting uh, there with exaggerated nonchalance. Man, I get all excited when school's over. This feeling of freedom is like such a rush. 
What are you doing here? I'm visiting. I wanted to see what it's like to be a student. I wanted to know more about the school. So, uh, the school thing that everyone goes to. And it's uh, much more fun than I thought it would be. One day, it won't be enough. <laughs> Plans to keep coming to school for me. Right. Hope it doesn't cause any problems. It probably will. Okay. Uh, let's go over to the roof. Because... I need to go and talk to the girl again. Oh, you, I was wait. I mean, what are you doing here again? No one asked you to come. Well, I'm busy, so what's on your mind? Um, <laughs> Sorry. Uh, looks like you want to learn. Or, do you need help speaking? <laughs> What? Where'd you get hear that? Oh, it's not like I'm worried about. Leave me alone. She's quite worried about her speech and defensive about it as well. Give her lessons. Um, let's see. So it looks like I want to learn to speak, and then let me teach you. Talk to her the next day and choose. Okay, give her lessons. You can speak well enough to teach others. You offer to teach her conversation lessons. I don't need them. Leave me alone. And if you don't want to teach someone, then maybe I'll listen to you for a while, just to be nice. I gave her some tips on how to converse with other people. Y you should have told me this earlier. Uh, oh, um, that's not right. It would have been more, most desirable if you <laughs> would have imparted this wisdom at a much earlier occasion. Like that? Um, thank you. I hope you can teach me again. Bye. She must be fuming right now. <laughs> right. So, do I have a sun persona? Here comes the sun. Bada bada. Yep, got the garage suit. Let's go to the second floor. My god, my room is heating up even more than it already was. Joyous occasions. Right. Uh, it's going to become closer soon. Yes, that's it. I see. I see, you're working hard, huh? I'm sorry, but you should go to practice by yourself. I have to summer to go. I'll drop by if I can make it. <laughs> Right, it's gonna give me expression, but it's already maxed out, so... You missed father's room. The door was open, so you cautiously went in. Now try speaking to him. Or, that's a, that's a, I'm sorry, the doctor. Now try speaking to him. Can you hear me? Look, it's Yumi. She's come to see you today. It's your daughter. Dad? Y you may. You'll be. Thank you. You are a kind girl, like your mother. I I'm not kind, not at all. You are a kind girl. You're your parents' pride and joy. You may be a bit angry and have a harsh tongue, but I know that's because you're trying to protect yourself. It's my fault. I'm sorry, I was so selfish. I caused you nothing but trouble. But seeing you at last, seeing you care for me, I'm such a lucky man. Yumi. <laughs> Yumi, it took your mother and me many days to come up with your name. Your name means bear fruit, because we wanted your life to be full of good things. What good things have I ever had in my life? Only you know that. Because you see, you made the good fruit of your own life. Or of your own lives. It's you. Of our own lives, sorry. <laughs> Jesus. Dad. Sob. No. You must keep breathing. Dad. Dad. I recognize her voice from somewhere. You never gave me the chance to say it. Dad. Thank you for bringing me into this world. I do recognize her voice from somewhere, but well, yeah, I don't know voice actors that well. Whew, that's a nasty one. You came. <laughs> Dad died. I, I just don't know what's going on. 
cry with her. Comfort her, sure. Thank you. Trying to come to terms with what happened. Please stay here a little longer. Stay by my side. You can feel that Yume is relying on you to help her. You feel that your relationship with Yume has deepened. Is this rank 8 or 9? 8, okay. Rank 8! <laughs> uh. Oh, I'm supposed to talk to the doctor. I'm sorry. Goodbye. I'll see you at drama practice. I hope. Bye, then. I hope that I see you at drama practice. Uh, another girl have to go and turn down in the next rank. Ah, uh, sublime. <laughs> Hello, Dojima. Yes. Uh. Ah. <laughs> uh, time for voice acting. Push Nanako to your room for some reason. What? Now then, first off. Seems Dojima has something in mind. Sorry, but can you go call Nanako down here? Take your time. You called Nanako as Dojima already to do so. To go over there. <laughs> a cake? Wow! What are we celebrating? Uh, well, today is a special day for us. A special day? That's right. Today's the day when you, me, and him become family. What about before? Uh, well. A anyways, it's the day that we become a real family. Hmm. I don't really get it, but it makes me happy. All right, let's eat. Yeah! You spent an enjoyable time together. Not a curious of all our energy? I'm fell asleep. Uh, well... <laughs> uh, sorry about making you go along with this. Hmm, it was fun. Huh. You're a nice guy. I felt like I needed to do this to draw the line. And I wanted Nanako to know. She has to know how important my daughter is to me. <laughs> She's looking more and more like Chisato. Her smile, her strong attitude. It was hard for me to even look at Nanako's face. Because she reminds me so much of Chisato. Chisato died because she went to pick up Nanako. There were times when I'd come close to believing that. But even then, I can't count the number of times she saved me just by being there. If I was living by myself, I would never have thought about taking you in. I think I was scared. Scared to have someone else around. I was afraid we'd become a family. And then I'd lose it all again. I was running away by chasing a guy who'd run away himself. <laughs> it was almost funny. <laughs> I've been scared this whole time. That's why I used revenge as an excuse to not spend time with her. <laughs> You've stopped running? That's right. I can't make Nanako wait any longer. Running, regretting, that crap all ends tonight. I'm not going to lose the things that are important to me. Never again. <laughs> nice. Rank up! That's the strength you've shown me. Thanks. All this work is paying off and it's so nice. It's so nice. Feels very good. Oh boy. Ahem. Yosuke? No, Yumi. Alright. <laughs> Are you going to practice today? I thought I'd drop by, but it's been so long. Come if you can. Bye. Alright. I think I will. It's raining today, so... There's not much else to do. Fucking Teddy, I swear to god. I still like Teddy though. I still like him as a character, but he's he's a bit like Yosuke, where he's just constantly fixated on the girl things, and yeah, I can understand it to a degree, but it's still a little bit stupid. All right. 
Yes. I see. You're working hard, huh? I have to too. And she finally gonna join again? Well, I can't judge her for not joining the four, but yes, she is. Yumi is back for the first time in a long time, a very long while, but she doesn't seem to be participating in the exercise. Yumi is still standing there, absent-mindedly. Hmm. What's wrong? I'm sorry. Oh, sorry. I didn't realize it was over already. After trying to act again, it's so different from the way it was before. Can't step into the role. I can become a different me. I don't want to. Huh. There, there's no one who will say my name like that anymore. No one to call me Yumi with that that voice full of love. No one, anywhere. Yumi clenches her teeth. <laughs> sure. <laughs> he has to cry like a dam is broken inside her. Yeah. I hated him. I despised him. Trembles when she speaks. I wanted to know why he left us. But I didn't want to know how he felt about us. I didn't want to think that he hated me and my mom. That's why I decided to act like I never had a father. When he abandoned me, I didn't think anything about him. I didn't think about myself being abandoned either. I just wanted I to run away. I just a wanted oh. to run away from all of that. I wanted to look the other way for my entire life. What should I do now? What did they mean by bear fruit? Hmm. Do what you can. Do what I can, but what can I do? <laughs> Just a day. Just this one day. Don't leave me alone. Trembles helplessly. <laughs> Trust you greatly. Yeah. Okay. So I actually don't have to deny people anymore, I think, once I have started uh, the thing. Maybe. Oh, no, wait. That's after this, right? No? Okay. I'll see you later. Uh. All right. Dojima. Dojima. <laughs> yes. All right. Let's continue working. Won't we come closer yet? I don't care. I want to finish this off. I'm so close to being done with this. Uh... The school trip is about to start, I think. Morning, senpai. It's actually gonna start probably. Yo. Yo. So are you ready for the trip yet? This guy won't shut up about it. <laughs> Yosuke senpai hasn't even started packing. He's all like, was that tomorrow? What's up with that? You are way too excited about this. I mean, you're even worried about how many boxes of animal crackers to bring. We're only gonna be there for two nights, dude. Besides, I'm pretty sure they have convenience stores in Port Island. For serious? I've never really left this place, so... Huh. I wonder if the murders here got as much play over there, too. Like that Mitsuo Kubo dude. They're still showing him on TV here. Every time I switch on the tube, the news is showing, like, what he wrote in his yearbook. <laughs> Pisses me off, man. The freaking media slapping together anything they can find to make the dude look like a born criminal. People think they can say anything they want about a guy who's been branded a criminal. It's just not right. I would say that's just how it is. I mean, I still hate the guy's guts. True. But I don't know. After getting involved with all this, I started to realize how off base most rumors are. It's so messed up. Well, I gotta admit, the news can be pretty out there. Hey, it's Naoto. Yo, how's it going? Good morning. Uh, oh, yeah. I I'm on duty today. <laughs> well, see you later. <laughs> <sighs> He's the messed up one. That dude really is tiny, though. Holy <laughs> shit. Oh, no. Really? Oh, it's you. Hey, 
Hey, you want to ditch class? Don't worry, we'll be back before the last belt. Ooh. This would be a new confidant, though. Sure. Let's do it. <laughs> really? Alright, then meet me at the shoe lockers. Uh, skip afternoon classes. This might come to bite me in the ass when I do exams, but... Can I? Thank you. I dragged you here. <laughs> hmm, it feels good. It feels so good just knowing everyone else is still stuck at school. Studying makes it feel great to be out here. Hmm. You shouldn't ditch class. Huh? Yeah? Then what's your excuse, smart guy? Confidence. <laughs> Social links. <laughs> it's not like I do this all the time. Besides, since uh, since they started keeping track of my attendance and behavior records, I've been a good girl. Well, enough small talk. Let's go. We'll start with clothes. Then we'll hit the jewelry and shoes. Maybe some cell phone stuff, if there's enough time. I seems, uh, only seems to be concerned about her own shopping. Sure. Of course you will. Why else would I bring you here? Anyways, time's a wasting. Calm, for not. Don't care about the lady. At least not for the moment. Oh boy. <laughs> Since I'm a personal servant, I can buy so much, so much more in this way. Paid for everything with a gold card. Hmm. Got money to burn? Well, I guess you could call my family new money. We may not have status or history, but we do have, uh, have money. My daddy made a fortune in land speculation. We'd better get going though, or we won't be able to make it before class ends. As soon as school, get, uh, school gets out, I'm the number one on the guidance counselor, counselor's office, whatever. He has to check on my attendance and behavior, and sometimes he tops it off with a lecture. It's a major pain. But I'm here having fun, and all the teachers are totally clueless how stupid can they be. You know what though? I had more fun today than usual. You're different from the others. I like you. I think I'll keep you around, but next time, let's go after school. There we go. Okay, you are prob- no, you're not the Empress one. Which one are you? Ah, the moon. La Lune. Okay, or La Lune, whatever. <laughs> the moon. The bloody moon! Alright. Are you coming, or maybe or maybe you'd like to be a blip on the guidance office? The guidance counselor's radar yourself. I'd rather not. See? I got a new link in any case, so I got a new thing I can work on eventually. Good to know. Alright. And I didn't even waste time getting it, so... I was about to say, like, what is that monster over there? And then I noticed it was Hanukkah. Or I think, is it called Hanukkah? Uh, is it called Hanukkah? Wow. No. <laughs> Let me see. I do have a strength uh, persona, right? Hanuman. Yeah. Yep. Let's see. It's going to become closer soon. Yes. Cole looks happy. Of course he should. More diligence. Samagawe Riverbank. Cole wanted to be by the river, so you stop by on the way here. Or on the way home. This place brings back a lot of memories. The first uh, time I came here was only my first time in town, right after the Ijijijo family took me in. The sky was totally clear except for the setting sun, and the light hitting the water made it shine. It was beautiful. It helped me decide something. I thought, from now on, I'm an Ichicho. I convinced myself that the old me was dead. At least, that's what I thought. But you were just a kid then, right? <laughs> yeah, isn't that crazy? A little kid thinking like that? I guess even kids have stuff on their mind sometimes. Funny thing is, I never really became an Ichicho. I looked, sounded, and acted like one, but it was just a mask I wore. And now I don't have to wear that mask anymore. Guess it's time to step off the stage. Hmm. We're going to leave. I don't know. It's not entirely my decision to make. Not after they've raised me this whole time. <laughs> it just makes me feel kind of empty, knowing that my real parents are dead. It's like I have no roots. We should go visit their graves after practice sometime. I wouldn't even know where to find them. I've got the letter, but whoever wrote it didn't sign it. They didn't mention my parents' names either. Whoever handed over you over to the f uh, to the orphans wrote that letter, right? Wouldn't that mean they've been holding onto it for like 20 years? 
It's pretty rough asking someone to remember what happened 10 years ago. 10 years ago. You're still carrying that thing? Yeah, well, I can't let anyone at the house see it, so... Huh? Hmm, the name on the front, Koyosama, is smeared. Like someone rubbed their hand against it. Maybe they just wrote it in a hurry. Plus, the corner of the envelope is sharp enough to give you a paper cut. What do you think? Huh. The letter was swapped? With the envelope and the stationery of the same insignia. Meaning this must have been written pretty recently. What does this mean? I think the head of the orphanage must have written it. When I visited, she could probably tell I was depressed. Uh, hey, cheer up, man. Even if it is a fake. Uh, it sounds bad to call it a fake, but... She didn't do it to pull a fast one on you. No, you've got it all wrong. I'm happy. I'm glad there are such nice people out there in the world. Maybe the letter is true. Or maybe it's just a nice lie, but all the same. Someone was there to give birth to me. Someone was there to raise me. And someone is there to watch over me like this. I thought I had no roots, no ties to anybody. But that's not true. Took you long enough to get the picture, stupid. Stupid, I know you I know you are, but what am I? No one would have told you that you'd always have us, stupid. Well, I'm rubber, you're glue. Ko's eyes are red, but he's laughing. Since we were able to support Ko when he needed you most. Rank 9! My god, man, I'm flying through these ranks. Well, I'm just finishing off these ranks, really. Man, you've got a you've got a really ugly mug, you know that? Wanna go for a swim, ugly? It'll be like old times. Huh, <laughs> yeah. Come to think of it, we used to play around here, didn't we? Right. How about you? Wanna go for a dip? <laughs> I better go home. What? Like you have a choice. Whoa, it's freaking cold! You horsed around in the river with Ko and Daisuke and then went home. Horsed around. Oh my goodness. I should end off my episode, I just noticed. So my friends, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Just How I Was Playing Persona 4 Golden. And next episode we're gonna go and... Just continue. <laughs> Goodbye.